Hi there! In today's video, I will show you how to manage display settings on your Samsung Galaxy Tab A9+. Plus. Let's get started. So, as a first step, we would need to open settings and then go to this tab, which is named Display. Here we can start. First thing that we see here is the light team and also dark team. By clicking on it, we can switch them and I think you can see the difference. Next thing that we can see here is the brightness, which we can adjust with the help of our finger, as you can see. And also here we can see this interesting function which is named adaptive brightness and it automatically adapts to the lightning on your environment. For example, if it's dark night, the brightness will become on the minimum and if it's bright sunlight, it will be on the maximum. Next thing that we got here is motion smoothness. By clicking on it, we can see here two options, which is standard, which is 60 Hz and it's just default basic one and also adaptive, which is 90 Hz and it gives you more smooth scrolling animation. Okay, next thing that we can see here is the eye comfort shield and if we will enable it you can see that the screen has become a little bit yellow. So this feature minimizes the blue color on the screen to protect your eyes. So now we can move on. Next thing that we can see here is the font size and style. Here we can see the demonstration. Here we would be able to choose the font style. Also here we can enable or disable bold font and adjust the size of text. You can see it. Let's move on. Next thing that we got here is the screen timeout. Here we can see options from 15 seconds up to 30 minutes. But always remember that the bigger the screen timeout is, then more it drains the battery. And next thing that we can see here is the edge panels. I can also show you how it looks. And we can here enable it, disable it, and by clicking on the name of the edge panels, we can also customize them. Next thing that we can see here is the taskbar, which is these applications at the bottom part on the tablet. And here we can also enable them, disable them and customize them by clicking on it. Next thing that we can see here is the navigation bar, where we can switch between navigation type. We have option buttons and we have also option swipe gestures and customization for the buttons. So let's move on. Next thing that we got here is the touch sensitivity, which increases the touch sensitivity of the screen for use with screen protectors. And last thing that we can see here is the screen saver. Show a screen saver after the screen turns off automatically while your tablet is charging. So this is it for today. I hope this video was helpful for you and thanks for watching.